guys, it's Matt from RC Overload, and I am out here with Brett and the Spartan. Brett's doing the filming today, so if there's any shakiness, blame it completely on him. <laughs> but uh, we're running 4S today. Uh, didn't have enough time to charge up the 6S LiPo, well, 3S LiPos. So um, we're only gonna do 4S and just see what it does. See if she sinks, see if she breaks down, which I'm hoping won't happen because I have no way of getting it if that's the case. So let's hope for the best. Yeah. Better that. That's the throttle cut off. Come on, girl. Get in. Get in. You can do it. Dun, 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 Okay. I'll go. Um, so it wasn't bad. 
she handled a lot better than I anticipated for this wet, uh, rough water. Yeah, water's wet. Uh, when I first got here, it was glass pretty much. Um, so that's what I was hoping to do some more high speed runs and whatnot. But that's a good run for now. Probably gonna upgrade the servo next because I noticed it seemed a little on the weak side for what I wanted. Um, so uh, we'll do that and uh, let's see. Motor really cold. ESC's a little warm, a little warm on the ESC. Servo seems fine. Um, but no, she felt good. Most of that run was all half throttle. Uh, I, as you guys saw, I only did a couple of full throttle runs. She did get really squirrely there. Uh, so I'm gonna probably have to play around with the tabs a little more, maybe upgrade those next as well. Um, but it's getting a little chilly and uh, we're gonna call it a wrap for today. Thanks for watching guys. I'll see you next time on the next RC Overload.